Alrighty here. We just got some new tricks in from uh, our local Longhorn. Not an advertisement. But, so, I'm going to go out there right now. See that the batteries died me on already. That's what's hard is. Uh, the light changes. Alright, so. Right inside this shed here. And we're going to go in. And let's see them. I still have to fill up their food, so I'm going to do that too. Alright. Cat safety lock. <coughs> Yes, I do need the sound effects, so you can hear them peeping already. Peep, peep, peep. And there. And the dogs, of course, want to come in. They can't, because if one of them, one on the floor, Russell would maul it, and Holly would eat it. They're taking a nap a second ago. That one friggin' already has, uh, it's losing its down already. This one is too, right here. It means it's losing its down, it, uh, it's getting its adult feathers already. And they're only like two days old. So, I can tell that those... And you can see the wing right there. It's losing its down, it's getting its adult feathers. They close their eyes weird when they sleep. What are you doing? What are you doing, Bobo? Huh? Yeah, it's cute. Oh, abduction! Oh, I didn't want to be abducted. He's fine. Yeah, they were taking naps, so I have their water right there. And I'm gonna put their food in here, but you have to first when you get them. They came in, uh, I don't know if you can see it. This box right here. I don't know if you can see it, but there's pooties in there. So they're in there for the ride home, and the car ride made them shit themselves because they're so scared. Yep, alright, so I'm gonna see if I can do this one handed and fill up the food here. See, these things are pretty cool. These little ties. Let's pick it up. Which I really get to this end. Let's pull up this tab. Let's put it down a little bit. Yeah, this kit now is the noise. Pull this tab. Bam. Just like that. Take that off. Get the food bowl. And there we go. And they're all set for a while. Now, of course, they're going to shit all over this place. So that's why we have the newspaper in there with multiple layers. So we just take out layers, like from literally underneath of them. And of course, when they get bigger, we're going to have to expand the box size. Right now, it's just an Otis Spunkfire oven box. This back down over here. There. Crap over everything. Anyways. Yes. So we have these chickies. Too bad they grow up into something so ugly. Zoom out, see if I can. Hey, buddy! Throw girls. <laughs> so I don't know why I say buddy or guys. See? Chicky! Chicky! Chicky, chicky! Sometimes. I, I've gotten them to sleep in my hand before, it's pretty cool. Probably won't get this guy to sleep in my hand, he's just too aware. He's pecking stuff on my finger. Do you know that there's food here, little guy? I don't know, you don't or you don't care. <laughs> he just jumped on the other guy. 
having a power nap, sleeping on each other. Yeah. Alright, well that'll do it for my trick adventures, but if you're really curious, something I've spliced this together anyway, I'll show you the, what they grow up into. Now, those are shit, on, different colors, and they're not the colors we have now. Right now we have Rhode Island Reds. Those are... I don't know what the hell they're called. This is the first time we've gotten that specific species. So, I don't, I don't know. But, uh... Yeah. They haven't pooped on me, but... Slimy. Anyways. You've got two different kinds. One... You've seen them, so I don't have to explain what they look like, but... These ones here are, uh... Simply just... Rhode Island Reds, and they went through a traumatic experience when they were little. Uh, when they first moved out to the coop here, um, I don't know, like a like a week after they moved out to the coop, and they're still little pullets. Oh my God, is that a shit? Oh, gross. If it is a shit, it doesn't smell. Anyways, <laughs> they were pullet size, and they moved out here. And, uh, let me go inside the fence. And one of them was attacked by a weasel. We had eight, so we have seven now. It's the only one that died. But, uh, so they became very scared and retarded. So they're bitches, basically. As they don't like to be pet or anything or held. Which I hope to change in these current chickies, because the more love you show them, the more love they'll return. These guys are just retarded. Anyways, I'll show you inside the coop while I'm here. Might as well. If you guys are curious, which you probably aren't, but hey. The water there, which I should clean out. Their food, which they just put on the floor and shit all over. Alright, we have eggs. And a Chicano Lang. Not anymore. Alright, see that's what I mean about the bitches part. Holy shit, there's a lot of eggs in there. Anyways. I'll collect those in a minute. But yeah, so... Like, the chickens we had in previous years... Were very nice to us. They'd let us hold them and pat them. Like, if I went out to the chicken coop, they'd be all congregated around the door right there. And I'd come in, and they all squat down for me to pat them or something like that. But these ones, they just run away. They're bitches. But anyways, uh... Thanks for watching. I think that's all I had to say. Yeah. Sayonara. Chickies are cute. Until they grow older.